Good morning, guys. I thought I'd bring you along for a little day in the life. We got my little half-dressed man here. I was <laughs> dressing him and then he starts spitting up my precious milk all over his neck. So I gotta change him. Say good morning. We also got this awesome view. There are some donkeys running around in the hills out there. So nice to wake up to this in the morning. So as you guys can see, we have a lot of toys around here. Got a lot of stuff on the uh, countertop. So we still are not unpacked. I'll show you though, we did hang up my glass whiteboard, uh, which we've had, I've had ever since I left for grad school. And I thought that I would cover the first letters of the alphabet. Aubrey already knows her letter A, but I wanna talk about like uppercase and lowercase letters. So that's why I have it written up that way. And then today I have some things to do in the kitchen. Hopefully I'll clear off some counter space before I actually get it all done. And I don't know, just bring you along when I play with Aubrey and be with my little dude here. So this guy is so close to rolling over. <laughs> He's not even three months yet, oh my gosh. Dude, come on. It's too soon. It's too soon. Much better. This big guy, oh my goodness. So like I said, this is my glass whiteboard. It's magnetic, but it only works with sun magnets, which is kind of weird, but uh, let me zoom out. It looks so small on this wall and I was envisioning like open shelves, like maybe on either side, but when we eventually have parties, I wanna like, we're gonna get a new table, press it up against the wall, have a balloon arch, write happy birthday. Like, I think it'll work out, but it does look pretty small. Uh, it looked huge in our Texas home. Can you smile for mommy? Yeah, I love you. But yeah, I'm just going to try to start cleaning up the counters. I hear Aubrey getting up in her room and just kind of get everything started for the day. Aubrey, can you say good morning to everybody? To the channel? Good morning to morning. It's Tuesday now. <laughs> Yay! Tuesday! It's Monday, but tomorrow's Tuesday. Oh my goodness. Well, this will be an activity. You want, you want, you want. Today is a big day. Why? Because it's beautiful. So I'm making a little coffee smoothie blended drink. I'm bummed our wedding blender finally died. It was like one little pump and or one little like press of the button and it died. So I found these guys in our registry collections and I was like, what am I gonna put in these? So I have my like coffee smoothie mix. This is instant coffee and then hot cocoa powder. And it's just perfect for like the drinks we wanna make. Sorry about Aubrey being loud. But I like how it looks on the counter. I think it looks a lot cleaner than like having the individual containers out here or being brought back and forth all the time.
did a good job lining those up. Mm -hmm. Hey, big guy. Ooh. Hey. Hey, big guy. He took a little nap. Did you have a good nap, Bubs? Did you have a good nap? Uh huh. I found the buried treasure. You found the buried treasure? I, I take the picture of it. <gasps> Look at the buried treasure. Now we have to sit around and take the picture off. Oh. <laughs> and one the chair. Okay. That would be one tough workout, huh? What? Bear crawls? Ooh, mountain climbers? Wow. I got some You're in better shape than me. Mommy. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna take a picture of it again. Okay. Bye, and you finally see. <laughs> I will see the door. Okay. You still come out, okay? Okay. What are you doing, Aubrey? Is this how you decorate?
Okay guys, so it's been a while since I've checked in like face to face with the camera. We did a lot. We had someone come out and work on the drywall in our garage. Um, I talked in one of my previous videos how we had some water damage. So they're kind of in the process of fixing that up. They did the texture, but we're waiting for that to dry and cure before they paint it and clean it up. So someone came out to do that. Aubrey and I did the banana bread muffins and they're looking pretty good. I'm excited to put them in my little kind of cake display. That's something I want to try to do more often is just kind of bake for myself, for my sanity and have those treats like out on display. Jack is down for I think his third nap of the day. It's, you know, his sleep right now. He takes a while to, for me to actually put him down. Like I put him down, he looks like he's knocked out and then he wakes up crying. And then I put him down again, like a couple minutes later and he wakes up crying again. So it's been a struggle. I don't know if he's going through a leap because like based on my little app that I have, he shouldn't be going through a leap. So maybe that's just off for him. I don't know, but he is napping. Aubrey is in day day time right now, which means usually a nap for her, but lately she's been skipping naps. So I don't know if she'll be taking a nap today or just playing nice and quiet in her room, but I kind of set like a one or two hour timer and go check on her after that timer is up. If she's sleeping, I let her sleep. And if not, then I let her come out here and kind of, you know, play and we do activities and stuff. But I do want her to continue to have that one or two hours of quiet time each day so that that I can get stuff done as well. And two other things that I forgot to mention in one of my house updates is we decided on um, the company for shutters that we wanna get, but it's gonna take a while. So we have some temporary shades up. They're just kind of paper, but they're nice. We can, you know, clip them up if we want them to be open um, or just down if they're closed. In the bedrooms and bathrooms, it's like a gray. And then out here in the living space, it's white so that it has a little bit more light but we will eventually get shutters in here probably in a couple of months. I think it's gonna take them a while to actually get them and make them and install them. And then the other thing that I forgot to mention, which was an issue was we had a little chip in our quartz countertops in our bathroom. So uh, someone came out a while ago to kind of patch that up. It kind of bothers me that I can definitely look at it and see like that was where the chip was, but at someone else's kind of glance. I don't think it's as obvious. So I think it's just something I'm gonna have to get over, but that was done. That was an update that I forgot to mention as one of the many problems that we've had with our new build. But right now I am going to enjoy one of my muffins and then probably just relax on the couch and edit this video that I'm currently filming uh, just so my life is easier later on. And if we still don't have internet by tomorrow, which is Tuesday, at least then I can have a little bit more time to upload it the way I've kind of been uploading it and not feel so stressed before Friday comes along. So that's what I'm gonna do. And I hope to, during this week, also film a couple other videos just to kind of get ahead for you guys because with all the moves and like the moving and stuff, like it's kind of been getting on top of me and I do not like feeling that way. So I'm gonna try to film more this week so that I'm less stressed. But I will make sure to check back in soon and let you guys know how the rest of the day goes. Okay, so my little dude woke up. I'm giving this setup a try for the first time. I tried having him face me just like with Aubrey and they just, as babies, I don't know, they just don't like being squished against my chest with this on. It's weird. But in order to get him fully like propped up, I did shove a little blanket in there so that he's not like eating this part. <laughs> um, and I think this is gonna work out pretty well. So we're gonna go get the mail with Aubrey. Her day day time is just about done and hopefully have a good rest of the afternoon. I promised Juan I would cook up some meat for him. So we're gonna get that done. I didn't get that much editing done because he woke up and Aubrey is having her own issues. So. Uh, I'll try to do some more editing later, but I'll check in in a little bit, but that's kind of what the plan is. Maybe I'll, you know, see a donkey on the way to the mailbox and film it for you guys. But let me go get Aubrey and we'll be on our way. Say hi, bubs.
Okay, so we just got back from our teeny tiny walk and we got some mail. And I have a question for you guys. So back when we were in Texas, I got this little metallic, and it doesn't come with the welcome thing. That, that was just a magnetic thing on it. Um, this little envelope and I like it for being like putting the mail that we're gonna send out or just when we get home, drop the mail in here and we'll go through it when we have the time. But I can't seem to find the perfect spot on our walls and it's because most of them are too big for this tiny little thing or they're too small. So as you guys can see, we have a lot of wall space, but this thing is relatively small compared to all of the wall space. So like obviously putting something right here might look a little weird with like a big open wall. I am considering this wall and hanging it like around here and then just having something next to it. I doubt Juan would like to have it like right here also because the kids. So I really just don't know where I want to hang it. I don't know if we should try to hang it on the little island, if we should put it by the thermostat, which is like the smallest kind of wall when we walk in. We have our little home sweet home set up already. Oh my gosh. Hey bubs, you're okay. Look, there's you. Yeah, I'm gonna get you out, okay? So if you think it would look well with the thermostat, what would go well with the, with the thing? I don't know. But now I promised Aubrey a bath, so. That's what we're gonna do. Juan recently got home, so we all are bathed. I cut Juan's hair and he brought home a bunch of uh, groceries. We got this big 10 pound thing of ground beef, which I will be portioning up and then freezing like sections of it so that we can use it over time. We got a bunch of like canned goods. I'm gonna be making my mom's birthday cake. So we got some of the ingredients for that. Someday I will get to making this pretty and more functional, but it's just gonna, things are gonna find a place and they're gonna stay there until we unpack. But Jack is sleeping and then Juan is gonna go to a reconciliation service tonight so that he goes before Easter. I'm gonna stay, get the kids ready for bed and I gotta eat dinner before Jack wakes up. So I think I'm gonna wrap up this little day in the life video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you are new. I'd love to have you stick around and I will catch you guys in the next one. end of the video. If you didn't know already, every Monday and Friday you can find motherhood and lifestyle content on this channel. And since us moms have to do it all, that may mean yummy recipes, easy DIYs, mom hacks, cleaning and organization, or just a combo of everything. Please know that you are loved and you are made for greatness, and I will catch you in the next one.